look at this high quality image. This has been generated by latent consistency model. Latent consistency model enable high fidelity image synthesis on pre-trained latent diffusion models. They reduce iterative sampling and achieve state-of-the-art text-to-image results. For instance, in this example, which is a replicate demo, and I'll drop the link in beauty's description, the prompt was self-portrait oil painting, a beautiful cyborg with golden hair, 8K. And you can see it is exactly to the hinge of it. And everything is what you have set in the prompt and more, and the quality is simply awesome. Another cool thing is that it got generated only in 3.3 seconds. There are also a few parameters which you can send, uh, set about the image, like width, height, how many images you want to produce, and then inference steps. Let me give it yet another prompt here and see how it goes. I'll say, just remove this panoramic view of white sandy beach with with few people 8k let's enter let's wait for it to come back you can even show logs if you want if there are any okay while it runs let me show you its github repo so this is a github repo where they have Hugging face demo, replicate demo, and also OpenX lab demo. And there are a few other things which you can do. Um, for example, local gradio demo if you want to do it, but remember you would have to install a lot of prerequisites and you need to have a beefy system for it. They also have LCA model download, but I'm, I haven't tried it out, so I can't really comment on that one. But the cool thing about this is that there are a lot of demos which you can use. They also have this abstract of the paper which on which all of this research is based. And in this paper, they discuss that this latent diffusion model has achieved remarkable results in synthesizing high resolution image. And I can vouch for it because that is true. And one thing is that there this new method, which is called as uh, latent consistency fine tuning or LCF is tailored for fine tuning LCMs on customized image data sets, which is a really cool thing, I would say. And these models are efficiently trained and can be fine tuned on custom image set data sets of your choice. Let's go back to that. Uh, it is still working and that's done. So you can see how cool is that? It's a panoramic view and simply awesome. Partially populated panoramic view and simply amazing. The quality is very nice and all the ingredients are there. I didn't mention the palm trees and stuff in my prompt, but still it was able to show me that. Let me see if it can recognize the people. We'll just remove this. I'll just say, Bollywood hero. Let's see how it goes. Because that should be in the corpora. It's quite a famous celebrity. I'll just let the law. Okay. I'm not sure if it's a Salman Khan, but okay. Anyway, doesn't look like it. It was able to give it a subcontinental look, which is cool. So let me see if it can recognize me. So I've just pressed enter. I'm not sure if it would be able to recognize me or not. Okay, not at all. So, but you can see the portraits are good. The quality is amazing. I mean, look at the how you know alive the eyes of this portrait are. So this is it, guys. I hope that you enjoyed it. Uh, and these are a few more examples from this research which you can readily play. I will drop the link to this in video's description.
so that you can play along. If you have any questions or thoughts, please share them in the comments. And if you like the content, please consider subscribing to the channel. Thank you.